I've got a solution. <laughs> this time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. That's just parable. Just follow the line. What? How simple is that? Why am I going this way? You see? The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct of one's subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? I have not been paying attention to you. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? what? I think what we need mm -hmm. right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Yes! Oh my god, this is awesome! Music, go back and look at that fern. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. We'll put the music back on. Okay, fern. Got it. Fern. Wait, what? We're back at the office? No, 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 line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Uh. Uh. Oh, no, 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 not again, line. How could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you... Oh, I can't take this anymore to hell with it. Restart. Uh, okay, we're back to the line. All right. Now what? You know what, Stanley? I can't forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Yeah. Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Oh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. How about this direction? Hold on. Look at 432's desk. His job was to sharpen a pencil. <laughs> what a hard job. All right, what's this direction? Now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go what wild. What the fuck? Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, what? Stanley, I'm ready for it. Can we have cake time? I want cake time. Cake. Uh. Oh, no, not you again. <laughs> Stanley. <laughs> I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. Yeah. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. 
We should be fine. Okay. Okay, I'll ignore it. What the fuck? Alright, see ya. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. All right. So I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere <laughs> the place where we're trying to go disrespect must be the our system that leads here. And that in turn means that our destination corresponds with the counter inverted reverse door's origin. Yeah. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, we the door left. on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. What? Ha! <laughs> oh, hold up. What's this? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game what, eight, eight times? What? That's really how all this goes? It's all determined? Wait, how many times did we restart? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Find the confusion. Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this, this thing. Yeah. Wall. Well, who consulted me? Anywhere do anything they restart to its own. Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? Again, begin the following line. No, it can't be. I, I don't want it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Good. And the time return stopped. Does that mean? Um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um, whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? This chair will attack me. So, okay. Stanley attempts to... I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah. I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always so saying that life there. is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. Yeah. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime... If this is really creepy. Okay. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. All right. I'm actually really creeped out. <laughs> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay, I will this time. Next time on UBZ, we're gonna actually go to where this thing tells me. Cause that was creepy.